So it's here, it's now, it's game time. Yes. Lost to a team that had bobbed the builder up front. And that's the end of that chapter. Woo! Alright, Dragos, what's happening? I believe my time ain't long. Marge, I'm confused. Is this a happy ending or a sad ending? It's here. It's now. It's game day. We're home for this one. We're off to the hive. It's Barnet, the Fleetwood Tan, in the first round in the FA Cup. Now, I'm not man of the world. Yeah. Oh, fucking twat. Oh, oh well. Stop it. Right now. All I want is for Barnet to say you love me. Shut up, you cunt. Or go your own way. It's time to stop. It's time to stop, okay? No more. But I'll still see you in my dreams. No, 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 stop it. People keep telling me, don't stop. But you should be ashamed of yourself. We win today and it's big love. No, God, please, no, no. It won't be little lies. Enough already, you're running out of steam. And if you search Lad Math BFC, you'll find me everywhere. <laughs> Got he! <laughs> was just seeing how many Fleetwood Mac songs I could throw in before it took you to clock on. But anyway, that's another chat in bollocks. Let's get into the football news! So Fleetwood finished 11th last season in League One, where they played 46 times, winning 16, drawing 13, losing 17, scoring 58, conceding 52, giving them a goal of plus six, and ended on 61 points. They currently sit fifth in League One, and the last five games have been two wins and three losses. <laughs> Joey Barton is in charge of the Fisherman. He took over on the 2nd of June 2018, where he's taken 72 games, he's won 26, he's drawn 18, he's lost 28, giving him a win percentage of 36.1. You might be needing a new manager soon, and not because of his results record. Number 17, Paddy Madden, who has 11 goals, one assist in 17 games. I don't care about your man! I don't give a fuck! Ah, oh, shit. Here we go again. The 19th of the 3rd, 2013, Barnet 2, Fleetwood Tan, nil. Mark Byrne and Luke Gambin with our goals. So, let's get to the grands. Let's get some team news in. Let's get the win and get into the next round of the cup. And then let's get the fuck out of Tan. Fuck you, Fleetwood Tan. Most irrelevant club. Copying Arsenal's grand just so you can get recognised now that you think you're the only hybrid. Even when fans were boycotting watching Blackpool at home, they still had more home attendances than you did. You bunch of wankers. Come on, Barnet! On it. Starting lineup for Barnet in a 4 5 1 today. Loach in goal, your back four of Shal Alexander at right back, Elliot Johnson at left back, Captain Canna Reynolds and Dan Sweeney as your two centre halves, David Tondra on the left wing, Maro Valletti on the right wing, three centre mids today of Ari Taylor and Jack Taylor and James Dunn, and up front, Josh Walker. And this is our Fleetwood Town lineup today in a 4 2 3 1. 17 minutes in, it's still 0 0. A very even game. Both teams controlling the ball well, holding possession well. Not many attacks happening. Best one from us, Elliot Johnson put a ball into. Jack Taylor who headed over the bar. 25 in, still goalless. Fleet would have worked on the right hand side quite well. Morris took all the whipping balls in. Not really dangerous enough that we can't handle. 28 minutes in, Barnet nil, Fleetwood tan one. Shambles in the box by us. We've been doing all right until then. Door whips a ball in, summer shattered, get rid, and everyone's just stopped and not done anything. Ched Evan, one nil to Fleetwood. A minute after that, great counter attack by Fleetwood. Hunting in packs now. Lokes pulled off a save to keep the score down. Just sloppy by us. Couple minutes to the half, Fleetwood are still leading, another chance for them, free kick goes all the way to the back post, Cheddar was unmarked, has a shot, Loach pushes it over, great shot, great save. Mm -hmm. 
half time here at the Hive, it's Barnet nil, it's Fleetwood Town one. We're not out of this game, it's only one nil. Fleetwood have had some good chances and Loach has kept us in it. We're playing one up front, a small man against two lumps, and it's, it's not really working for us going forward. We need to change it up to get more attacking threat going. Because every time we are crossing the ball in the box, we don't really have much in there for it to be aimed at. The goal we conceded was just an absolute shambles. 45 minutes of the FA Cup remaining. Come on, Barnet. Minutes into the second half, still losing 1-0, not what lies happened in the second half by both sides. No one's really having an attack. 12 minutes to go, Fleetwood still lead 1-0. We're just going for the motions now. We've got one up front, we haven't done anything. Fleetwood had another chance, which Loach has pushed, went for a corner, they done nothing with it. Five minutes remain of normal time. The score has not changed. We had to clear one off the line from a corner from Fleetwood. But we're just drifting out of this cup. We can look like we don't want to be in it. In the 90th minute, they've added on four extra minutes, but it's Barnett, nil, it's Fleetwood Town 2. They caught us on a counter-attack, Hunter making it 2 nils. We just went through the motions this game, we didn't really look up for it, we didn't look like we had any urgency about us, and Fleetwood, they didn't really get out of second gear. Been quite easy and comfortable for them. The game finished Barnet nil, Fleetwood Town two. I can't help but think that we were trying to lose this game so we didn't either have to muck about of a replay or even get into the cut run like we'd done last season. And look at the fixture pile up we got. We was controlling play, passing it around nicely. It was hard to break Fleetwood down, but as the game grew, it just looked like we was going through the motions where we wasn't really that interested and we didn't really want to be in the cup competition. One up front for 18 minutes of the game and we didn't have our first shot on target until the 92nd minute, which was a header from Sweeney. Fleetwood didn't really really looked troubled, wasn't really out of second gear, quite comfortable for them. They should have scored more than one. Loach kept the score down. If it weren't for him, they could have had about four or five on a day. They broke through our lines a couple of times. Well, we just struggled again with plan A, let alone talking about having a plan B. It is a shame because I love the FA Cup and compared to what we had last season, should have defended the first goal a lot better than we did. But when the ball lands to someone like Chad Evans, he's going to pull it in the back of the net. Fleetwood's second goal, great counter attack. They cut us open and there's a good finish as well. But they was always going to get that second goal they kept knocking on that door we lacked a few ideas going forwards it was better when Mason Clark came on and he added a bit more pace and energy but we were still having only one in the box every time we got into good positions and crossing the ball in crossing it to the smallest man on the pitch against four big lumps at the back well that's the FA Cup for a season there's more I can say I can't be bothered well done to Fleetwood Sand good luck in the next round Stockport County up for us next at the Hive you know what to do ta -da.